I started racing in 2010. Uh, it was very occasional, a uh, few races here and there in service. Uh, last year I joined the full championship, it was my first season. I started with beginners, little by little I stepped up to the Royal class. And now? And now I perform pretty good in the Royal class. Uh, compared to last season I was 16, today I am 4th. I am very satisfied with the progress. New bike? Yes, uh, the new bike is of course part of the success story here. And uh, I'm looking forward for next season to get even better. Do you have uh, friends here, Romanian friends? Of course, I have many friends here and I, I'm also a fan of many people here. Really? Of course, yes. <laughs> Istode, Kazaku, Zoli, uh, many good people here really helping. I think this is one of the reasons why we, we chose this place as the place to be because people are very helpful and supportive and uh, the atmosphere is good and, uh, and, and the level is also very good yes the level is for us you know for us is very good maybe it's not the world championship but for us it's a good platform you know to to make a step forward uh, up until the last year basically we didn't even have uh, legislation for motorsport Mo uh, any s racing activity was illegal uh, last year there was a change in this, but and there there is some some things going on in our country, but still we don't have a, a speed circuit, you know, we don't have good places to race, you know, they they talk about building, and I hope it will happen, but in the meantime, you know, there are some guys here who decided that they're not going to wait another two, three, four, five years. We just want to enjoy racing right now. Expensive to you. It is expensive, but um, you know, at the same time, I think the Romanian superbike still remains the, the most cost effective solution for racing for us because uh, the value for money is very good. You get a lot of track time compared to other championships like Alpe Adria, or, and uh, the participation fees are okay. And uh, also, there are, as I said, there are many people who help us here. We have an arrangement with the transportation that is very important for us because we have to take a plane to, to come here. We do not because ride a truck. Asking. Yes. So uh, it is expensive, but it is, it's not the most expensive. And it's the, the best value for money for us at the moment. And uh, also, you know, we have very high taxes in Israel and having a bike like this in Israel is two, three times more expensive. So if you compare the bottom line, uh, it's not that expensive as, uh, you know, racing uh, in Israel, I think, would be when it will be.